This is the Roland TR626 rhythm composer. It's a drum machine from the 80s, around the time of the TR707. I guess it's a later model. It also has a lot of connections, uh, single outputs, stereo output, phone output, and MIDI input output. You can synchronize it to tape and also save your patterns to tape but also to a smart card uh, which I don't have and you can also use uh, my foot switch to for some procedures it runs on batteries that's what I like about it uh, in the 707 batteries are only for preserving the memory uh, here it can run the whole drum machine I like battery operated things so I like this one too um, the display is pretty much like in the 707 if you switch it on it's automatically in the track play mode so there are six tracks you, you can see a track track is just another word for song the most useful uh, setting is pattern play and if you've just um, switched it on it will be in pattern group a which are preset patterns a b and c are presets And D, E, and F are user patterns. So now I'm in pattern group D, pattern play. It's possible to mute single instruments but it doesn't have a built-in mixer like the 707 and muting isn't very intuitive or quick you have to go to the level by pressing this button once and then you can while it's running select the instruments uh, where you want to set the output string so how to program this thing let's go to an end so if it's not running, you can listen to the sounds. Um, here you have the possibility to switch sounds with instrument change. Different bass drums, different snare drums. And also some Latin American instruments, but there's no whistle on it.
Okay, you get the idea. Also, nice rice symbol. Um, altogether, I think the selection of samples is not that balanced as in the tier 707. You can set the pitch for each instrument by pressing shift and then same button here with pitch underneath it and then you can tune it. to program it you have to press shift and write and there's the step write mode and there's also a tab write live recording mode where you have to press shift and write again if you press write without shift you're back to pen and play so if it's not running you can and if you're not in that menu, you can select the pattern you want to program. So, if you have to delete the pattern, you have to press clear and pattern, and then it's deleted. So, we'll try to program something on to pattern 12 now it's running if i go to um tap right and press inst metro i have a metronome which is played by the rim shot takes I didn't want to have the conga I wanted to have the hand clap so and to change that I go to step right uh, and select the instrument Undelete the steps. So there's also a shuffle setting. You can set a shuffle with different settings. I don't like the shuffle feeling of this machine too much, but it works for some um, occasions. There's also the possibility to set flams. So if you want to set the shuffle, you have to press shift, shuffle, hold shift, and then you can select a value between zero and four. I think only one and zero are usable and the same is for flam hold shift press it twice the down button and then you can select flam 
strength it also yeah one one and two are usable and the other is not and if you want to program a flam you have to press uh, shift while putting um, an alt onto, onto the step so I want ah, okay if it's not running <laughs> you're changing the pattern so I need to let it run select instrument snare so I want the second snare to be with flam Okay, let's um, put the levels back. So I want to Delete this pattern again, press clear. I'll, I'll go out of this menu, I'll clear and press the number of the pattern, then everything is gone again. A good thing is that you can chain, chain patterns. Um, I try to chain four patterns, pattern 12 to 15, then it says block. And I also can edit all four uh, in one row. So let's try this. Um, okay, now I lost it again. Um, so go to tab right, metronome, and here the pattern is displayed which is edited in this moment
then there's um, the accent the accent is not for all instruments but per track and you have i think seven levels um and the way this works is uh, also kind of special you have to let it run okay again select the patterns get out of this mode uh, one two three four block select accent and then you go to the instrument to run and then you then you can select like each step and select Accented um, notes in tap writing mode. We'll just try this. In an, on a new pattern so pattern 16 is empty and go to trap right mode
also set different scales. So select the last step. So this is basically it. So it's, as you've seen, it's easy to make mistakes. Um, the instrument change uh, just between um, hand clap and conga, and the instrument selects the track. And there's also a possibility to set it to manual play while in step writing mode. song mode or track mode yet but I like the fact that you can play patterns um, in blocks uh, this allows for very long patterns like in 80s um, hip-hop like Run DMC or so This is the problem of this particular machine. Something goes off um, if you shake it.
this video is way too long but I think I I don't want to to cut it uh, oh, we'll just see